Welcome to Forensic Detectives. I am Dr. Koji Gas, me the gas detector. And today, folks, we are talking alcohol gas detection. Alcohol, folks, it's not the Jim Beam or the whiskies. We are talking ethanol, methanol, and isopropanol. These are important gases that typically off gas from a liquid and they can create a dangerous explosive environment at your factory, in your manufacturing facility, or in a research and development environment like the lab we have at Forensics Detectors. If you don't have enough ventilation, enough airflow, the alcohol can accumulate and create an explosive situation. Not to mention, not to mention, not even getting to the explosive point, but it can create some health effects when you're exposed to it within several PPM. So we have an alcohol, an alcohol gas detector in PPM. It is calibrated to isobutylene here in Los Angeles in California at the Forensics Detectors Laboratory. And the way it works, folks, it's pretty easy. It's a personal protection device. You could pop it on your belt, pop it on your man, and you could all, you could do point sampling, hold it and walk around the facility slowly. And you could take your air quality measurement with this alcohol detector, and you could see the numbers rise or fall or stay at zero. It all depends, folks. Now, how does it work? We have the sensor right in the middle, right over there. It's a made in Germany sensor, folks. Think of Mercedes, think of BMW. In other words, yes, high quality sensor technology in this gas detector. All the alcohol molecules diffuse naturally onto the sensor, and then the sensor translates that into a current. And within the unit, we have a calibration curve, and it presents you with the concentration that it's detecting and it's going to give it to you in parts per million there are various OSHA thresholds regarding alcohol so you have to make sure you're abiding with those OSHA thresholds now we're going to do a little test over here we have isopropanol again we're talking about off-gassing folks typically we have off-gassing occurring that means we have the gas molecules leaving the liquid phase, going into the gaseous phase, into the gas, into a vapor, and then it creates a dangerous situation. So as an example, you saw what I just did. I put some liquid isopropanol on my little rag here. Now I'm gonna give it a little exposure. Oh yeah, I could smell it, okay? A little exposure, and you're gonna see the numbers going up here, folks, okay? I'm not gonna leave it there for too long, but you could see the numbers going up. Once it reaches, I'll put that on mute. Once it reaches certain thresholds that you can set, it will alarm, it will buzz as you heard, and it's vibrating, hear that? And it's vibrating. So you get the attention, you get the warning signal to take action, folks. That's the way it works. Large battery USB recharge. It comes with a USA NIST calibration certificate for you, again, Big battery, we're talking about a belt clip, you could pop anywhere you want. And we're here in California, if there's any follow-up, if there's any questions, just let us know. You could also bring it back to have this calibrated and things like that, folks. So in other words, we're here, we are going nowhere, we're not gonna go and hide under a rock. We are here, 100% service just for you folks, okay? Now, what else is there, folks? Oh, 30 day money back guarantee and one year warranty. So there's no risks, folks, no risks. You don't have to worry, oh, who's forensics detectors? Oh, I don't know about that company. Oh, I don't know about that detector. We are here, folks. No risk at all. Dr. Kaiser is here. You could call, you could email, and you could speak to me directly if you have any questions, okay? Look, I hope that makes sense. Make sure you're grilling those burgers for me this summer. Be well. See you soon.